so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! Hey, it's me, Mika! And today I'm at Ball and Bounce in Encino, California. <gasps> Look at this place, it's so colorful. This looks like a great place to bounce and have fun and have a lot of playtime. Oh, but first things first, I need to take off my shoes. Let's go over here. Shoes off, shoes off, it's time to take my shoes off. Shoes off, shoes off, it's time to take my shoes off. <laughs> hey, now that I've put my shoes away, it is time to bounce and play. Well, let's go. Wow, check it out. I think this is like a zip line. You can hang on to this bar and go all the way down. Oh, I gotta try it. Thank you. <laughs> Whoa, look at this floor. Can you see that? All these different colors. Oh, it's kind of like a really colorful hopscotch. Let me try it out. One, two, one, one, two. <laughs> Wow, that was so fun. Kind of reminds me of a rainbow because there's so many different colors. That reminds me, I have a game we can play in my jam pack. Check this out. I have a bingo card. See all these spaces? We can find different colors today and then we can use these stickers to mark down the colors that we found on the card. Will you play with me? <laughs> nice. I wonder how many colors we're going to find. Let's start looking. Let's go find some colors. Let's go find some colors. Oh, oh, look at these blocks. They're so colorful. Hmm. Let's see which ones I want to pick out. All right. Let's see what colors we have. We have... Orange. <laughs> Can you think of something that's orange? Maybe a pumpkin <laughs> or a carrot? <gasps> Do you know what animal really likes carrots? That's right, a bunny rabbit. <laughs> okay, orange. Do I have an orange sticker on here? Oh yeah. All right. Put this on our chart. Okay, the color orange. And the next color is blue. Hmm, something blue. The sky. Oh, I love seeing a really clear blue sky. <laughs> Let's see. You see blue on here? There it is. Nice, bright blue. And our next block is, do you know? It's one of my favorite colors. Yellow, that's right. Can you think of something that's yellow? Maybe a lemon? Oh, have you had a lemon before? They're really sour, but also really tasty. <laughs> or a banana? <laughs> All of these foods are making me a little hungry. Okay, let's see. Let's find the yellow sticker on here. This is such a fun color, I think. Do you know what it is? It's pink. Yeah. Ooh, can you think of something pink? I sometimes think about cotton candy or sweet treats that are pink. <laughs> That's really fun. Um, there's kind of two pinks on here. I think I'll go with this pink. <laughs> and the last color is green. Okay, something green. Maybe green grass or, ooh, broccoli. I love broccoli or cucumbers. <laughs> okay, let's find the color green on here. Oh, this is a good green. And we'll put it right here. Look at all of those colors. Will you count the colors with me? Okay, one, two, Three, 
four, five. Five colors added to our chart. <laughs> hey, maybe we can build something really fun with these blocks. Hmm, maybe a fort or a house or a castle or... <gasps> what about a throne? Yes, a royal throne, and then I can be Queen Mika. All right, I'm gonna try it out and see if I fit on the throne. Hello, it is I, Queen Mika. Thank you for coming. Oh, yes, sir. What's your name? Oh, <laughs> nice to meet you, Malcolm. Thank you for coming to my royal kingdom. <laughs> this is so fun. You know what? You can sit here if you like. Enjoy, Malcolm. All right, let's see if we can find some more colors. Come on. Whoa! <laughs> Did you see how fast that was? Oh, this place is so fun. And whoa, this is the most colorful ball pit I've ever seen. Wow, look at all of these colors. Woo, I feel like I'm in a bowl of rainbow sprinkles. <laughs> hey, I wonder if I could juggle. Let's see, usually you have three balls. Let's see. <clears throat> ah, I still need to practice. I'm pretty good with two though. Whoa. Oh. Ball pits are so much fun. You can do a lot of things in ball pit. You can dance, you can fall. <laughs> you can make angels in the ball pit. Ooh. Or you can even take a nap. <clears throat> oh, sorry. <laughs> I was dreaming about those rainbow sprinkles. <laughs> You see something behind me? Like what? <gasps> a climbing wall! Oh, that's so fun! Look, you have all of these steps that can help you climb to the very top. Should I try it? Okay. I'm ready. I will start with the color blue. Blue. Oh, and look, there's yellow and there's red and oh, I'm already at the top. You look so small down there. Hi. <laughs> Fall back into the ball pit. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. We have, oh, there's another green here. Do you see a green sticker? Yeah. Right there. And, oh, I stepped on dark green on the climbing wall. So maybe we can use another green. What other color? Oh, what about red? Like a red apple or a red tomato. You see red on here? Oh, yeah. And, oh, here's another yellow, like the sun. Okay, we'll put our yellow sticker there. Look, the top line is already filled up. Ooh, we could put some more colors on here. Um, another orange. <laughs> or another mm, blue. Maybe another red. And let's find two more colors. What do you think? Oh. Maybe the bright pink. Yeah. Yep, pink. <laughs> and another green. <laughs> and another orange. All right, I think that's pretty good. Should we find some more colors? All right, let's go. Whoa. Bounce like a bunny with me. Oh, I wonder what's in here. See you on the other side. Hello. <laughs> Ooh, more colors. Bounce, 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 bounce. Whoa, 
this looks fun. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, it's kind of like a little slide. <laughs> hey, there's some more colors here. Maybe we can fill up the chart a little bit. Oh, do you know this color? One of my favorites, <laughs> purple. That's right. And there's a purple sticker right there. Put it there. And, oh, can you see on the side? There's some pink, pink. There's a pink sticker. Okay, any other colors? Oh, look behind me. I see yellow. <laughs> There's a yellow sticker. Put it right there. And, oh, you see red? Wow, it's really filling up. Look, we only need one more sticker. <gasps> Let's see if we can find our last color. <laughs> oh, look at this. Hmm. Some kind of animal, I think. It's green and has two eyes and a really big smile. Looks like this. <laughs> hey, I think this is a frog. Do you know what sound a frog makes? It goes ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> and frogs bounce too, just like bunnies. <gasps> hey. Green can be our last color. Look, this green is almost the same green as this frog. All right, check it out. We filled out the entire chart. Look at all of those colors. Five, six, seven, eight. Now it's time to celebrate. And I see a great place to celebrate. Come on. Let's bounce like frogs over there. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. <laughs> it's time to take a break to wiggle and shake and bounce. Do you see what this is? It's a trampoline. Will you bounce with me? <laughs> All right, let's do it. What a fun way to celebrate filling our color cord. Hey. Will you bounce like animals with me? We bounced like bunnies and we bounced like frogs. <gasps> what if we bounce like a kangaroo? Let's do it. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> what other animals? <gasps> I wonder how a T-Rex would bounce on a trampoline. Maybe like, <clears throat> Really happy T Rex. <laughs> How high can you bounce? I feel like I'm flying. <laughs> oh, bouncing with you is so much fun. Let's get our color chart and go. Come on. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> I had so much fun with you today at Ball and Bounce. Hey, thanks for helping me find all of those colors. Check out our bingo color chart. There's so many different colors. I love it. It's so colorful and so beautiful. I know. I think I'll give this to my very best friend, Blippi. <laughs> He'll love it. <laughs> well, this is the end of this episode, but if you want to watch more of my episodes, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> cool. M-E-E. -E. K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> well, I'll see you next time. Bye. Whoa. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today we're at Creation Station in Studio City, California. Yeah, I love this place. This is a place where you can dance. Yeah, they have dance lessons here. And you know I love dancing. But first, I have someone really special to introduce to you. Hey, Blippi! Hey, Mika! <laughs> Hi, everyone! This is Mika. She's my best friend! Oh, Blippi, you're my best friend! Oh, so silly! <laughs> I'm so excited because we're at a dance studio! Yeah! Are you ready to dance? I'm so excited! Yeah, let's go! Come on! Whoa! Well, we should probably warm up before we do some dancing today. Yeah, great idea. Look at all these things we can warm up to. Oh, yeah. Cones. Check them out. Look at the colors. We have
have a yellow cone. Orange. <laughs> Ooh, bluish purple. Purple. <laughs> Ooh, another orange one. Ooh, <laughs> green. Yeah, and one more. Blue. Yeah. All right. All right. How about we uh, use our feet for some agility? Ready? Yeah, go for it. Whoa. Really fast, Blippi? Yeah! Whoa! Whoa. Your, your makeup? Whoa! Hey! A hula hoop! Yeah! Why don't you try hula hooping? Okay. Here whoa. we go. You put it around your waist and you... Whoa! 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 Yeah, Mika! Whoa! You're really good! Thank you! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> whoa! Check it out! Three orange balls! Whoa! Can you juggle? Yep, I can! Why don't we toss them to each other at the same time? Yeah, let's try it. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Whoa! Whoa. Three, two, one. Whoa! All right. Whoa! Nice. Whoa! 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 <laughs> All right, are we warming up the stretch? Yeah, let's do some stretches. All right. Yeah. Oh. Set your toes. Oh. Oh yeah. Feels oh. good. Yeah, it does. Ooh, nice leg stretching. Now we're gonna Ooh. be able to dance really good. Yeah, I cannot wait to dance. Oh. <laughs> 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 <gasps> Do you hear that? Yeah, it sounds like beautiful music. Yeah, I wonder if someone's dancing to the music. Let's go see. All right, let's go. Yeah. dancer and I was just doing some ballet. Wow. Would you guys like to learn some ballet with me? Yeah! <laughs> Excellent. Um, come on over to the bar. We'll oh, okay. get you guys all set up. Whoa, Ooh, cool bar. What ballet? is this? Thank you. Uh, this is our ballet bar. Oh. Our professional ballerinas learn balances and how to be more flexible all with this bar. Wow. So the first thing a ballerina needs to know is first position. You're gonna get those feet together nice and tight. And just open up your toes like a pizza pizza. Pizza. And then stand up super tall, yep. And I like to only put two fingers on the bar so we're not putting too much weight on it, but just enough to stand super tall. Okay. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> now there are some ballet moves that we need to know because they're important and then there are some that are just super fun. Oh. So we're gonna start with one that's important. Okay. And always use plie. Can you guys say plie? Plie. plie. Excellent. We're just gonna bend down but keep tall. Keep yep, and then stand it back up. And then Whoop. down. And up. Oh, you look like a real ballet dancer. <laughs> yes. Do you guys think you know what plie might mean? Our knees do it when we do the plie. You're bending. Yes, that's so good. Plie means to bend. Oh, ah, that makes sense. We kind of look like frogs, though. Yeah. Like we're about to <laughs> jump in the air. Exactly. That's what we're doing. Whoa, really? Yep. We're going to take that plie and we're going to jump straight up into the sky. Wow. And land back in that first position. Whoa. Wow. Yep. That was and that really move cool. is called saute. Can you guys say saute? Saute. Perfect. Saute means to jump. jump. You got it. You guys are so smart. Whoa. 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 So good. <laughs> okay, another important one now. So that one was super fun. Huh? Yeah. Another yeah. important one is passe. Passe. You're gonna slide that toe up to your oh. knee, finding your balance. Keep that knee pushed back. Stand super tall. 
and you're just gonna lower it back down. So it's kind of like an oh. elevator ride. Your toe takes up the leg. Do, 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 yeah. do, 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 do. Toes going for a ride. And then yeah. back down to first position. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Whoop, 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 whoop. Excellent. Whoa. You guys are <laughs> pro. <laughs> so good. Wow, that is really fun. One more at the bar. Okay. okay. Also super important. Okay. okay. Tondu. Tondu. Yep. It's kind of like what you did next door, and it's the first thing I do in the morning. Ugh. It means to stretch. Oh, I okay. love stretching. Ugh. And it's for our leg and our ankle. So you're gonna stay in that first position. You're gonna do your best to slide that toe forward. Ugh. Keep your toe on the floor, and then slide it back. Ooh. Perfect, wow. and then use the other leg. Slide it forward as far as you can and stretch. Ooh. And then bring it back to first. Oh, that feels good. Yeah, yeah it does. Time to do. 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 Excellent. Whoa. So that's to the front. But you can also go side. Okay. Whoa. And to the other side. Whoa. And you can also go back. Whoa. Whoa. And then you can connect all those tondus and make kind of like a circle around yourself. Whoa. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, it kind of feels like skating. Yeah. Whoa. We learned a lot of ballet already. Yeah. So cool. many words, huh? Wow. Now we're gonna, if you can help me move this bar, I'm gonna teach you just like two or three more fun oh. words, and then we can put two music. Okay. <laughs> Thank right. you. There we go. You got enough space there? Yep. Perfect. Okay, we're gonna stay in that first position. Okay. Feet first. are together, toes are open. Let's push our hands on our hips. Yes. <laughs> we remember saute. So saute. Means to? Jump. 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 Excellent. So we're going to do eight super quiet sautés. Oh, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That was perfect. <laughs> now we're going to jump open and close. Whoa. Whoa. This All is right. called a chapé. A chapé. That's a new word. Yeah, it is. It's kind of like a jumping jack, so it's super easy. Just jump open, use that plie, and then jump close. You got it. A chapé. Echappé! <laughs> One more! Echappé! Yeah! Nice. Wow, we did really so good. good! Can I give you one more jump? Sure. Yeah! Okay, instead of being in first, I want you to take your heel to your toe. Boop, 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 boop. This is called fifth position. Fifth. Okay. Yeah. So this jump, we call it changement, and it means to change. So oh. all you have to do is jump up in the air and land with your other foot in front. Okay. Oh. Can we try? Yeah. One, Sounds tricky. Two, three, Sean, Do this! Oh, yeah! <laughs> that was perfect. Let's try to do three Sean Jmas in a row. All right. Ready? Okay. Yep. Sean Jma. Sean Two. Sean Jma. Perfect. You guys. Yeah. That yeah. was oh, awesome. Really yeah. Really yeah. Really yeah. That. that was so, awesome. I'm so proud of you guys. You learned so much. Yeah. Thank you so Thank much you. for teaching us. You're welcome. <laughs> I don't know, do we want to put it to music? Yeah, sure. that sounds fun. Yeah. All right, let's hit that music. All right.
teach another style of dance too if you guys want to learn it. Yes! <laughs> what style is it? Tap dance. <gasps> yeah! yeah! That means we have to change our shoes and then okay. we'll come right back. Okay. All right, let's all right. go! Let's yeah. go. All right. Whoa! Wow. Yeah. You guys put your shoes on super fast. Yeah, so thanks. excited. Oh, you did too. Yes. Wow. Thank you. Okay. Two important things to know about our tap shoes before we start. Okay. okay. The tap shoe has two metal shiny parts, right? Oh, uh huh. Wow, they do. Okay, we have oh. to learn what they're called. Okay. So up here, I mean, what's in that part of your tap shoe? Are your fingers in there? No. No. Oh, it's your toes. toes. So we're gonna call this the toe. Okay. 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 The other part is called the heel. Heel. The heel. Exactly uh -huh. right. So the first few things we learn are gonna be super easy peasy. Put that leg out. Don't let it move. But you tap your toe. Ooh, I love that sound. Excellent. Wow. Good. Can we try the other foot? Now we're gonna use the same part of your shoe, but you're gonna put it behind you. Ah. Oh, uh huh. It's called knock knocks. Yeah, like Excellent. knocking on a door. We'll try the other foot. <laughs> knock knock knock. Knock knock knock. Excellent. <laughs> now with the knock knocks, you can switch. your toe. Just like walking. 
heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe. You guys got it. Yeah. <laughs> that was really fun. Yeah. Should we try to put all those tap moves into a tap dance? Yeah. 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 All right, let's Cue get that some music, music going. Okay. <laughs> Teaching us how to tap dance. You're welcome. Excellent memories too. Oh, so thank you. You're a great teacher. Thank you. Yeah. You know, I have another teacher here who teaches another style of dance. If you are up to learning one more style, yeah. yeah. He teaches it? hip hop. <gasps> Whoa, hip hop sounds really cool. Yeah, it does. Yeah. His name is Mr. Caden, and he's just down the hall. Here, follow me. Okay, we're gonna okay. get our shoes yeah, first. Yeah, shoes. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Go. <laughs> I'm Mr. Caden. I'm a hip hop instructor here at Creation Station. Wow, that was really good. Yeah, that Thank was you. Good. Do you guys want to learn some hip hop moves? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, first, do you guys know what hip hop is? Hmm. A type of dance? Yeah. Yes, it is a type of dance, but it's like all types of dance mixed together into one. Wow. wow. Cool. cool. Yeah. It's like ballet dancing and tap dancing and jazz dancing all put together. Wow. And there we have hip hop. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, do you want to move, learn some moves? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ready? First, yeah. we're going to dust off our shoulders. Ready? Oh, we're going to take our left hand and we're going to dust off our shoulder. Oh, like it's dirty. Yeah. <laughs> Ready? And then we're going to do it to the other side. Okay. And dust it off. Dust our shoulders. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <Yeah. laughs> Wow, you guys are so good at that. Oh, thank, thank you. You too. Oh, thank you. Okay, ready? Do you want to learn another move? Yeah. yeah. So we're going to raise the roof. Raise Whoa. the roof. Ready? You're going to take your hands. You're going to place them up like they're on the ceiling. Like that. And ready? You're going to push the ceiling up. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's really heavy. Yeah. Right? Raise the roof. Yeah. Raise the roof. Wow. Raise, raise the roof. roof. <laughs> raise the roof. <laughs> Perfect. Wow. You guys are really good at hip hop. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ready? Another move. We're going to put our pants on. Ready? All we're going to do is we're going to grab it and put it up. Oh, okay. Whoa. So ready? Yeah. Grab your pants and put them on. Okay. Okay. We're going to do it to the other side. Ready? All right. Grab your pants and put them on. Oh. Yeah. Let's try it one more time. Ready? Okay. Grab your pants. Put them on. Other side. Grab your pants. Put them on. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo. <laughs> okay. Ready? Huh? We're going to learn another hip hop move. Whoa. Whoa. So many moves. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? We're going to do a hip hop slide. Do you guys like water slides or anything like that? Yeah. I love going down slides. <laughs> so much fun. Well, ready? We're going to learn a hip hop slide. So all you're going to do, you're going to take your hand and push it away. At the same time, you're going to slide your feet over to the right side. Oh, OK. Whoa. Whoa. You do the exact same thing on the other side. Take all your right. right hand. Push it away, left foot, slide. Whoa! Whoa. Ready to try over time. Ready, slide to the right. Whoa! Oh. And slide to the left. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I messed up. <laughs> Tell you okay. Yeah. Ready? We're gonna learn a super 
cool move. <gasps> okay. Okay. Yay. This is called a floor spin. <gasps> what? <Yay>. Whoa. <laughs> okay. All you're gonna do, you're gonna stay on the floor. Ready? Let's stay on the floor. All right. Okay. Ready? We're gonna sit with our feet out, just like this. Right. All you gotta do, make sure you have all your weight on your hands behind you. Okay. okay. All your weight on your hands. Yeah, yep. I think so. Ready? All you gotta do is you're gonna push your hands around and then strike a pose. Whoa! Yeah! yeah. All right. Ready? Do you guys wanna try it? Yeah! yeah. Ready? Let's go! Ready? Go. And go! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. And ready? Strike a pose! Whoa! Yeah! Yeah, Mika! <laughs> okay, Flippy! That was awesome! That was awesome! You guys did so good! Thank you! Okay, now that we've learned all those hip hop moves, do you wanna put it into a fun hip hop combo? Yeah! Okay, ready? Let's stand up and dance! Okay. Let's do it! <laughs> Woo! So, first, we're gonna start with raising the roof. Let's go! Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! to the Blippi and Mika dance recital. Hope you enjoy.
dancing. Yup, ballet, tap, and hip hop. Yeah. <laughs> what one did you like doing most today, Mika? Mm. Oh, I really love tap dancing with those cool tap shoes. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm, let's see. Well, I love tap dancing. That was cool. Yeah. Hip hop was awesome. Oh, yeah. And ballet was so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> All three were so cool. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B L I P P I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> Wait a second. How do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show you. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Cool. All right, see you again. See you soon. Bye-bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at Play Day in Brooklyn, New York. Today is all about fashion and style, which I love because fashion helps you express your personality. Check out my outfit. I have two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Oh, and I love accessories like my jam pack and my watch. And because today is really sunny, I have one of my favorite accessories, sunglasses. Hello. <laughs> I feel so cool in my sunglasses. And I heard I get to put more things on my outfit inside. Come with me. Hi, I'm Mika, what's your name? Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. My name is Laura. Welcome to Play Day. Oh, thank you. What kind of things can I do here? Oh, we have so many awesome classes. You can do painting, sculpture, cartooning, architecture, and fashion design. <gasps> fashion design? That's what I'm interested in. I want to add some things to my outfit. Great. So the first thing we can do is start with a mood board. Have you ever made a mood board? Yeah, I've made a mood board before. A mood board is a board of pictures and colors and words that inspire you. Okay, great. So let's get started. Follow right, me. Come on. Wow, this is a big board. Well, Mika, this is your mood board and here are all the materials that you can use. And here is your apron. <gasps> Thank you so much. So have fun and I'll come check on you in a bit. Okay, thanks. See you soon. Whoop. Oh, I'm so excited to make this mood board. Okay, let's see what we have. <gasps> Whoa, look at all of these colorful balls. Ooh, those are really fun. <gasps> There's some paint. Hmm, what should I start with? start with purple, one of my favorite colors. Hello again. Hey, what do you think? It looks great. Can you tell me a little about what you made? Sure, I'd love to. So I put the word confident on here because confident is the feeling I feel when I wear this outfit. And I have music notes because I love to sing and dance. And I have a big purple M because M is the first letter of my name, Mika. And it's purple, one of my favorite colors. I think we're ready for our next step. I think we have enough inspiration, so we should do a sketch now. Oh, a sketch. I know what that is because I'm such a planner. Fashion designers will use a sketch to help them plan what they want to make. Okay, so let's go. Follow right, me. Come on. Wow, this is cool. So one way to make a sketch is by tracing your body on the chalkboard. And then based on your mood board, you can add all the elements that you want to put on your garment. Wow, what a good idea. Okay, Mika, can you please lean against the chalkboard? Oh yeah. Thank you. All right. Yeah, for fashion designers, it's super helpful to plan and sketch out a idea or design before you make something. Ooh. <laughs> All right, how's it looking? I can't wait to see. Okay, Mika. Ready? Yes. All right. <gasps> yes, I love it. I'm feeling inspired already. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now you can add the elements to your design and I will meet you at the sewing station. Okay, see you there. Bye. Thank you. Okay, so 
first, I think I'm gonna draw the outfit I'm wearing right now. So, what am I wearing? What do you see? Yeah, my purple t-shirt. So, let me find some purple here. Whoa, look how big this chalk is. It looks like a potato. <laughs> All right, so let's see. T-shirt, short sleeves. Okay, that. All right, I'm gonna color it in. And do you notice anything else on my purple shirt? Yeah, I have some yellow on there. Whoa, look at this piece of chalk. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do some yellow here on the sleeves. And yellow here. And where else is there yellow? Up here, around my neck there. Some yellow. And I have a yellow pocket. <laughs> Right side. Ooh. Okay, what else do I have? Purple shirt and my jeans. Okay, I'll use the color blue. All right, and you can see a little bit of my ankle, so I'm gonna cut them down here so I have room for my shoes. I'm gonna color them in blue. Okay. Blue jeans, my purple shirt, and oh, my accessories. I have a compass watch that's purple and yellow. So I'm gonna use this purple again. And let's see. There's yellow on it too. Oh, I'm feeling like such a little designer. <laughs> Okay, let's see if I can copy it. There's a little yellow there. There's a little yellow there. And the rest is purple. And there's a white circle in the middle. Can you see it? It's really tiny. Okay, that. And then check out my bracelets. There's blue, yellow, purple, orange. Wow, that's a lot of different colors. So we get some purple on there, blue, and ooh, a little orange. Okay, and yellow. Awesome, and oh, speaking of yellow, I have a yellow bow in my hair. Oh, I should draw my hair. It's brown and curly. Can't really tell what color this is. Let's find out. Ooh, look at those curls. Go on, Mika. Woo. Okay, okay. And then I'll put my yellow ribbon here. Mika, you look amazing. All right, and I have some white and purple and yellow ugh, shoes. Okay. Whoa. Okay, some shoes. And, hmm, I feel like something is missing. I have my bow, my shirt, my jeans, my accessories. <gasps> my jam pack! Oh, I forgot my super fun jam pack. Okay, let's see, I need blue and orange, and there's a white circle in the middle, <laughs> just like my compass watch. Okay, so I need orange and blue, and I'll use this black to draw the strap, and then the big circle. Okay, so there's blue on top, and blue on the bottom. These two are orange. And there's the white button in the middle. Okay, yes, she's looking great. <laughs> okay, so I wanna add 
something, I think, to my shirt. There was something on my mood board that got me really excited. Do you know what it is? It's the letter M for Mika. I think it would look so cool if there was a purple letter M right there on my pocket. So let's see if I'm right. Oh, it's kind of hard to see. Yes, yes, that's what I want. The letter M sewn onto my shirt. That way my outfit will look super complete. And I think I'll just add some little bedazzle here on my bag for fun. And I forgot my face. <laughs> All right, two eyes, a nose, and a giant smile. Twins. <laughs> All right, let's go over to the sewing station so I can get my M put on my shirt. Come on. Hey. Hi, Mika. I'm so excited to be at the sewing station. Welcome. I have the sewing kit ready for you. <gasps> Did you decide what to do with your design? Yes, I'm so excited. I want to add a purple M to my shirt. That's great. So I'm going to give you another shirt so you can change. Oh, cool. All right, thanks. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Hi, Mika. Hi, thank you for the shirt. You're welcome. <laughs> so I have my shirt here ready for the letter M. That's great. So first thing we're going to do is talk about the materials that we oh. will be using. Yeah, there's a lot here. So for sewing, we use needles, mm -hmm. plastic needles for kids, and sharp needles for adults. Whoa. So make sure that you have a grown-up with you when you're using those sharp needles. Yeah, good idea. We also use thread and scissors. Oh, so needles, thread, and scissors. Got it. Perfect. So to thread the needle, we're going to pass the yarn or thread through the eye of the needle. Oh, oh I bet the eye is right here on top. That is correct. See that opening? Ooh, that looks kind of difficult. <laughs> so don't worry, I have a trick for it. Okay. You can fold your yarn, mm -hmm. so that way it's easier to pass through the needle. Oh, smart, okay. Perfect. So next, you're gonna choose the color that you're gonna use. Hmm, there are a lot of great colors. Oh, I think I wanna use orange. I love this color. <laughs> Perfect. So now, we're going to cut the thread. Okay. To measure, you hold it with your fingertips. Where's the end? Where there it is. is. <laughs> <laughs> and then pull it to your elbow. Okay. Ooh. And that's a perfect size to start. Nice. You want to cut it? Yes. Team work. Perfect. Love it. So now we're going to make a knot on one of the ends of our thread. Can you make a knot here? Yes, perfect. And we're gonna call that the tail. Whoop. Got a little tail. And now you can thread your needle. Okay, should I try your trick? Yes. Okay, just like the professionals do it. <laughs> I'm gonna be very careful because the end of this needle is sharp. <laughs> so close. Oh, oh, oh. That's fine. I can do it for you. Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's really tricky to do. Yes. It's okay. It takes practice. I have to practice more. All right. Nice. <laughs> Thanks for your help. You're welcome. So now you can start sewing. Another tip is that you hold both the needle and the thread when you're stitching. That oh. way, the thread will stay in the needle. Got it. Okay. Oh, I don't have the letter M. <laughs> no worries. I have it ready for you right here. <gasps> wow. It's exactly what I had in mind. Look, it's purple, one of my favorite colors. Oh, thank you so much for making this. You're welcome. Okay, so I think I want it to look like this. Hold it up so you can see it. What do you think? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So cute. Okay. So hold both the needle and the thread. And I'm gonna watch my fingers here because it's really sharp. And just poke a hole. And then pull the needle through, right? Yes. Okay. Make sure you pass all the threads through. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Good job. I did it! My first stitch! <laughs> Okay, and then go back through? Yes. 
Okay. Jeez, it's harder than it looks. <laughs> hey. Okay, look, it's starting to stay on the shirt. Good job. Now you secure your M. Okay. Thank and you. You can add a few more stitches. Okay. Let's see, maybe I'll do one right here. Okay. The final stitch. All right, now what do I do? Well, now we can cut the excess thread. Okay. I can help you. <gasps> thank you. I can take the needle. Oh, thank you. Be careful. Yes. All right. <gasps> I can't believe I just did that all by myself. Great job, Mika. Thank you. What do you think? I love it. Oh, thank you so much for helping me today. You're welcome. I hope you had a good time and keep practicing everything you learned today. I will. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Mika. See you Bye. later. Bye. <gasps> okay. I can't wait to put this on. See you soon. <gasps> Check it out. The letter M is on my shirt and I think it looks really good. <gasps> I love it. Now my outfit is complete. Oh, and I have one more thing for fun. For my jam pack. Ooh, nice. <laughs> I had such a fun day. I got to make a mood board, a sketch, and I sewed my very own M on my shirt. This was so cool. And what's cool about fashion and style is you can express yourself through your clothes and accessories. <laughs> Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> all right. I'll see you later. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we're at Nailed It DIY Studio in Orlando, Florida. DIY means do it yourself. And today we're gonna build and make art. Oh, I can't wait, come on. Oh, look at all of this stuff. These are all signs that people have made and that's what I get to make today. Oh, look, this box says meow. Oh. I wonder if it's something that you could put cat treats in or cat food. Oh, and look at this one. All guests must be approved by the dog. <laughs> That's really funny. Oh, I see some paint colors down here. Let's see how many colors they have. A lot. Oh, I wonder if they have two of my favorite colors. Do you know what they are? Oh, they're purple and yellow. And they're right next to my best friend Blippi's favorite colors. Blue and orange. Huh, that's cool. Wow, these are all the different wood pieces that you can use to make art. Oh, look at this one. It's pretty small. You can have a small sign that says, welcome. <laughs> Or, whoa, look at this. This giant rectangle could make a really cool sign and it could hold a lot of words. Maybe it could say something like, welcome friends, come on inside for snacks and games and good times. We love our friends, welcome. <laughs> and here's a square. One, two, three, four even sides. And there's bigger squares up there. Hmm. Oh, cool, a circle. A small circle and a really big circle. Hmm, which one should I choose? Uh, I think I like this one, the medium stack square. That's number 07. We have to remember that, 07. Okay, come on. Oh. Hi, Margie. Oh, hi, Mika. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm pretty good. I'm excited to make art today. Awesome. So did you pick a size? Yes, number 07. Perfect. And did you want to add anything to that? Oh, um, oh, maybe that silver hook right there. Okay. Oh, and can I also have that bow tie? For my best friend. <laughs> Absolutely. So we have your station set up over here. You ready to get started? Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. 
Okay, we have everything we need. We have lots of cool paint, two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Oh, well, this one's called dandelion. Fancy. And we have pearl and latte. We also have a paint roller. Easily put on the paint. And we have some sponges. We have silver hooks. And we have our crown stapler, our power stapler, and the stacked wood piece that I picked out. See, it's actually four little pieces. And when they're stacked together, it makes one beautiful square. <laughs> and what are these for? So these are actually to hold the wood stack pieces together. Oh, okay, makes sense. So what's the first thing we need to do? So your first step is to put a line of glue on each one and then flip them over. Okay, I think I can do that. Okay. Now what? So we have these lines here and oh, those yeah. are actually where you are going to put the staples. Oh, so these lines, it's like a little guide. Exactly. So first we are gonna put our safety glasses oh, on. Oh, right. If we're gonna use a power tool, we need to be nice and safe. And remember, only use a power stapler if you are with a grown-up. Whoa, you're really good at that. <laughs> Think you can do that? Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna follow the black lines. That's my guide. All right, good teamwork. You are a pro. Oh, you did thank good. you. <laughs> All right, so oh. now you're gonna flip it over. And there you have it. Look at this perfect square. What's the next step? So the next step is we're gonna take it to the sanding station where you're gonna make it smooth. Ooh, let's make it smooth. <laughs> Come on. So this is the sander. Okay. What you're gonna do is put one hand here one hand under here. Mm -hmm. There is a power button that you want to push. Okay. Once it's on, you are going to run it over the whole thing until it's as smooth as a piece of paper. Oh, all right. Well, why do you want it super smooth? It helps the paint stick to the wood. Oh, okay. So let's make this super smooth. Time to sand. are going to choose your base color. So we're gonna look oh. at your stencil. <gasps> yes, I can't wait to see. All right, so this is the stencil we have for you. Wow, look at this. An ice cream cone, one of my favorite sweet treats. And oh, that's my name and my headband. Oh, and this is gonna be my bag. And this other stencil will help make it really look like my bag. Oh, I love it. Okay, so for the base, um, I'm thinking purple. Yes, yeah. that is a good color. Okay, so I can just put it everywhere? Yep, so you're just gonna squeeze that over the top of the wood. Okay. Okay, and I get to use this really fun paint roller to spread it all over the wood. So you're gonna paint the top and then all of the sides. All right, now we just wait for it to dry? Actually, we have a way to dry it quicker. Oh, how? So we are going to use this blow dryer. <laughs> You've probably seen a blow dryer before. It's to dry your hair. So there is that. You are gonna blow dry it on the base setting. Okay. <laughs> cool. Is it ready? Ready to go. Okay, turn it to base and let's dry! Okay, now what? Oh, it is dry. Cool. So now what you wanna do is sand it until it's smooth again so that we can put the stencil on. Okay. This time I'm gonna give you a piece of sandpaper as well so you can sand over the top of it. Nice. Oh, cool. It's purple sandpaper and it's really rough. 
but this rough piece of paper will make this smooth. Hey, those are opposites, rough and smooth. Woo! <laughs> Bobby pin. <laughs> All right, like this. So you're gonna go back and forth over the whole thing, just like that, yes, perfect. Okay. All right, so your board is nice and smooth. We are ready for the stencil. Yes, all, all right. right. So the stencil has a couple of layers. We are going to peel the white layer off first. Oh, it's like a giant sticker. Yes. All right, so I'm gonna hand you one side. Okay. And we are gonna center it on your board together. I think that looks good, what do you think? I think it's pretty good, yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna stick this on. Okay. I'm gonna give you a squeegee. A squeegee? Yes. I know what that is. This is your squeegee. Yeah. What you wanna do is run it over the whole thing. And you see how it turns a little bit darker? Mm-hmm. That's how you know it's really stuck to the wood. Cool, and this is gonna push all the bubbles yeah. out. Yes. Okay. Bye, Bubbles. So now that it's all stuck to the wood, what I want you to do is peel this top layer off. Okay. We're actually gonna start from over here. Ah. Uh -huh. And pull down towards you, slow and low. Slow and low, my favorite way to go. Oh wait, oh, come on, sticker. Well, I did it! <laughs> wow, that looks cool already. <laughs> all right, so now we're ready to paint. Yes, all right. So, hmm, I'm gonna start with the ice cream cone, and I'm going to use pearl. That way it will look like vanilla, one of my favorite flavors. So what you wanna do is dip the wide end of the sponge, that end of the sponge, into the paint. Okay. Take a look at it. Does it look wet? Yep. That's too much paint. Oh no. So what you wanna do is dab it off and you can use the paper or you can use the plate. Okay, I'll dab on the plate there. All right, look at it now. Does it look wet? Nope. You're good to go. So now you're gonna just dab up and down. Okay. For the whole thing. Like this. And is it okay if it gets on the blue part? Yes, it is. Okay. It's a stencil, so that part is gonna come off. All right. So let's cover this ice cream cone. Okie doke. Perfect, so now you can pour your next color for the cone. Ooh, and the cone, I'm going to make that a latte. We look like a sugar cone. I'm gonna be careful because I don't want it to get on the top of the ice cream cone. But even if it does, we can always fix it. Oh, you know what? I like your attitude, Margie. Okay, that cone's looking pretty tasty. Yes, it is. All right. So what color did you want to paint your name? Oh, my name, I want it to be yellow. Yes, I love it. All right, so let's go ahead and pour the yellow. Okay. So yellow there, wide end, dab, dab, dab. You got it. Oh yeah, now I'm feeling like a pro over here. Let's see, my headband is yellow. So I'll just use the same yellow. <gasps> Margie! What happened? I need two more colors for my bag. You're right. Do you know what colors are on my bag? Yep, blue and orange. All right, so go ahead and pick the blue and orange that you want. Okay. Down there. Oh. This is good, and oh, this. Ooh. Yeah, this will look cool. Okay, do we need the other stencil yet or no? Not yet. So okay. what we're gonna do with this is once we peel this up, we'll put this one on so it really makes it look like your back. Awesome. So I should start with this one, I think. Dab, 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 and get the whole bag. Perfect. All right, so take a look at it. Do you like it like that, or do you want to do another coat? 
Oh, I think I like it like that. Perfect. So we are going to give this one good blow dry again. Okay. And then we're ready to peel. All right, let's do it. So this time you are going to blow dry on the stencil setting and just be careful, it is powerful. We don't want everything flying away. Okay, I'll be careful. <laughs> Here we go. Whoop, that is powerful. <laughs> it's dry. So now it is reveal time. Oh, okay. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. So we're gonna turn it this way because we wanna peel the stencil against the grain. Oh, okay. Do you know what wood grain is? Uh, you can explain it. Okay. <laughs> so the wood grain are the lines that you see in the Oh, wood. that's right, yeah. So if the, if the lines of the wood are going this way, mm -hmm. we wanna peel this way. Oh, gotcha, against the grain, exactly. okay. Exactly. So you're gonna start with one corner and then peel down towards you. Towards this corner or each? Down towards you. So, yes. All right, let's see how it looks. Whoa! Uh-oh, there's a little piece That's stuck. That's okay, it can rip, it can tear, that's totally fine. Oop, there we go. Oop. Whoa! That looks so cool! How good you did! Wow! Check it out! So now we are ready to put the other part of your bag on. Oh, that's right! We have another stencil. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna peel the backing off and we will center it together. Okay. You're good? Looks good to me. Okay. All right, ready? Let's commit! Oh, we did it! <laughs> You're ready for your paint. All right, let's get the orange on there. I think that looks pretty good. Okay, do you remember what comes next? We have to dry it. Yes, okay. Okay, now what setting should I put so it on? So you're gonna be on the stencil setting. Makes sense. Here we go. It's powerful. There you go. Woo! Everything's about to fly. I in. know. <laughs> okay, so do you remember the wood lines? Oh yes, you wanna go against the grain. Yes. So we wanna go this way? Correct. Okay. There's my bed. It looks so good! Oh, this is so, so cool. So now I just need two hooks because I want to be able to hang my headband and my bag. <laughs> All right, so we have the hooks right here. Okay. I'm gonna have you pick two hooks out of there. Yep, two hooks. Whoop. Okay, we have one, two. So we are going to be using a power tool again. Okay, so, so we need our safety glasses. You know it, safety first. So I will drill the little holes to get the hook started and then you'll screw the hooks in. Sounds good. Let's put this one right here. Okay. You're ready All for right. the hooks. Two holes, and here we go. So I can just twist them in, right? Correct. Almost there. There we go. <gasps> it's finished. <laughs> wow, look at the sign. I love it so much. Thank you, Margie, for all your help in helping me make this awesome Mika sign. You are so welcome. <laughs> well, I guess I'll see you around. Yeah, sounds good. We'll all see right. you next time. All right, have a good one. Thanks Bye. again. You're Bye. welcome. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wasn't that so fun making this really cool Mika sign? <laughs> Today, I got to build a sign, sand it, and paint it. Art is so much fun. <laughs> Thanks for playing with me. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool! Oh, we 
can spell it right here on the sign. Ready? M E E K A H. Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time. Bye. Wow, Mika, cool. Yeah, this room is filled with different art pieces. Yeah, check it out. Here, do you want one? Oh, yeah, thank you. Wow, unicorn mugs. These are so cool. Oh, cheers. <laughs> Yum! Whoa, there we Ooh. go. Oh. Nice and gentle. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, check it out. Cool. Of course, yeah. mine is blue. Yeah, and mine is red. Oh. It's so cool that you can even make cars out of clay. Yeah, awesome. Oh. 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 Well, this pottery is so cool. New pottery is an art piece that's made out of baked clay. Yeah, or other types of stoneware. Yeah, it's really cool because it starts soft and squishy and then it ends up like this. It's nice and oh, hard. Yeah. Oh, cool. Hey, look at this. Whoa. Oh, I'm being very careful when I hold these. Good job. Yeah, a yellow flower. Yeah, it's so pretty. Yeah. <sighs> it smells <laughs> just like clay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. Whoa. Do you see what I see? Yeah, I do. Whoa. Ready? Do you know what animal that is? <laughs> A lion, yeah. Yeah, will you act like lions with us? <laughs> 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 cool that an artist made this lion out of clay. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Yeah, and it's so colorful too. They must have painted it. Yeah, look at the blue eyes. Whoa. <laughs> okay, I'll very gently when I set that down. Nicely done. Oh, thanks. Hey, Flippy, there's more animals down here. Oh yeah, you're right. Look, a bunny rabbit. Aww. <laughs> nice little carrot right there. It's so cute. Oh. oh, what about this little elephant? Aww. Little elephant, but big ears. You got that right. <laughs> oh, and look at this one. Oh, oh, what is that, do you think? Huh, maybe a leopard? Oh, yeah, and it's really big, almost like a blowfish, but it's not a fish. <laughs> yeah, mm. so artistic. Yeah, really cool. You can make anything you want. Yeah, and it's so cool that these animals, yeah, are nice friends together. Oh, so cute. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Look, there's another one up here. Oh, interesting. Looks like a pig, right? Yeah, and purple, one of my favorite colors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, but wait a second. It's all alone. Yeah, and it looks like there's some space for other animals. <gasps> Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah? Lunch time. time. No. Oh. <laughs> we can make this pig some animal friends. Oh, that's a great idea, Mika. <laughs> My name's Nicole. Oh, oh, nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. Hi, and I'm Mika. Oh. So what do you do here? Um, I'm the owner and instructor. Wow. Oh. Cool. Well, you might be the perfect person to ask. Do you think we could make some pottery today? Of course. Oh. Yeah. Oh. We want to make some animal creatures. Awesome. Well, would you like to hand build or throw? Hmm. What's the difference? Well, hand building is where you can use your hands to sculpt, and throwing is where we use the pottery wheel that spins. Oh. oh could we do both? Of course. Oh, yeah. yeah. How do we get started? So, if you guys want to grab some clay, and I'll meet you at the wheels. All okay. right. <laughs> Thanks. See you later. See you. Oh, cool. Oh, look at all this clay, Blippi. Wow. Big <gasps> blocks of clay, it looks like. Yeah. Oh, look at this one. Kind of looks oh. red. Yeah, you're right. Almost like a brick. Oh, yeah, look down here. Whoa, this was like a dark brown. Oh, yeah. Oh, and look at these. Oh, Ooh, a nice tan color. Yeah, and the shape of balls, it looks like. Yeah, interesting. Hmm, Let's look we? inside. I wonder if they're the perfect size. Oh, check it out. Whoa, cool. Yeah. There you go. One for you. Oh, and thank one you. one for me. <laughs> oh, cool. Oh, and I have a great idea. Whoa. And since they're pieces of clay, and they won't get ruined if they fall on the ground. I know what you're going to do. <laughs> yeah, here go, we go. go yeah. Whoa, well, nice job. Thank you very much. I should probably put this third one away, right? Yeah. <laughs> Let's seal up the bag so then they don't dry out, right? Good idea. <laughs> All right. 
<laughs> nice twist. <laughs> All right, here, you are. here we go. All right. Oh, check it out. Oh, scales. Yeah. Whoa. We could weigh our clay. Yeah, do you want to go first or me? Oh, you go ahead. <laughs> oh, thanks, Mika. All right. Hey, there we go. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Looks like one pound. Oh, nice. Wonder if mine's going to be the same or different. Yeah. Oh, also about one pound or <laughs> half a kilogram. <laughs> so silly. Well, I think they're good, shall we? Yeah, let's get started. <laughs> Okay. okay, I'm so excited. Me too. Okay, we'll set that there. Ooh, aprons. Oh, smart. So then we don't get dirty. Yeah, this will protect our clothes. Yeah, and it even says cobalt and clay. Oh, cool. Matching aprons. Yeah. Oh, Hi, hey. Guys. Hey, Nicole. Hey. Are you ready to throw? Yeah. yeah. Right. Throw clay. <laughs> So I'm gonna go over a few things that we're gonna be using. So we have a bucket of water here that's gonna help the clay glide through our hands. Uh huh. And then the way the wheel works, there's a foot pedal on your table. You're oh. gonna set it on the floor and that's gonna control the wheel speed. Okay, and do we sit down? Yeah, you're gonna sit I'll on your sit. stool. <laughs> cool, <laughs> nice and relaxing. Whoa, okay. the pedal's on the floor. And that's what you use to control the spin. And then what about the clay? So you're gonna take it, you're gonna smack it in that center circle. Uh -huh. You'll tap the sides really well, seal the base, and then you'll just start to mold your piece. Sounds okay. like fun. <laughs> thank you so much. Okay, I'm gonna set up our next station. All right, thank you. See ya. See ya. Okay. Ready to throw it? Ready to throw. Whoa. I missed the center. <laughs> Me too. We Let's should do probably do that again. Oh, whoa. Three, two, one. Yeah. Whoa. Nice. <laughs> Okay, and then I think she said to use some water oh, yeah. on our hands, Let's right? Water our hands. Okay, water our hands. Water, water our hands. Water, 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 water our, our hands. hands. <laughs> okay. Okay. There we go. All right. Smack Ooh. it. Oh, and then she said seal it, right? Oh, so maybe push yeah. it down. I, and... I think we go around the edges like this, so then it seals from this plate. That sounds right to me. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> That's fun. Really? Yeah. Can't wait to try. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Oh, it actually goes pretty fast, what huh? Does it? Whoa. <laughs> yeah. <Wow. laughs> My clay is going for a ride. <laughs> yeah. Mine's a little off center, so I'm going to push it in the center. Yeah, like that. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, maybe it'll work. I don't know. <laughs> Whoa, look at my hands. Oh, mine too. Whoa. Sticky and slimy. How about a clay high five? Oh, it's <laughs> on my face. <laughs> that's silly. <laughs> Doing clay can be pretty dirty. I know, but it's really fun. fun. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, All here right. we go. Whoa. 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 Okay. Don't let go of your clay. <laughs> Kid, you're so silly, Mika. Oh. How are you doing? I don't know. Whoa. I don't know. I can't stop. It's pretty wobbly. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Whoa, look at that blue. Yeah, making a cereal bowl. Oh, cool. Whoa. All right, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think mine's going to be a little wobbly. Whoa. Oh, should we take a look? Yeah, let's check it out. Oh, okay, I'm gonna Whoa. keep going with that shape. Let's see. Whoa. Whoa, look at what I made. Oh, that looks amazing. Yeah, like a bowl. You can put all sorts of knickknacks in here. Yeah, or you can put little snacks in there. Oh yeah, smart. Ooh, and it's so cool because when you wanna go higher, you just Pull it up. You don't even have to spin your hand around. Blimey, you're such a natural. Oh, thanks, Mika. Ready? Whoa. Here we go. Whoa. Oh, my oh, goodness. No. Let me do that. Oh. Oh. It's actually harder than it looks, huh? Yeah. Mine broke. Oh, yours looks pretty cute, though. Oh, well, thank you. Oh. Well, shall we go to the next station? Yeah, let's try it out. <laughs> oh, this is fun. All right, come on. Okay, yep. washed hands, I think we're ready. Yeah, I'm so excited. Yeah, all right. And what's oh. this station called? Hand building. 
hand, hand building. building. Whoa. So do we build with our hands? Yeah, we're gonna um, sculpt our animals right now. Oh. Okay. Is this the body or the head? This is gonna be our animal body. Oh, oh okay. Fun. Ooh, and look at this. Whee. Wow, it's kind of like the wheel we were at before, but smaller. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. And what's this one for? We're gonna use these to make our attachment to like the animal's limbs and maybe like some fins or some whatever you're trying to create. Oh, cool. cool. Well, huh, what kind of animal do I want to make? Ooh. Um, maybe a tiger? Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, what about you? I think I might do a dinosaur. Oh, fun! Yeah, with plates down the back. Ooh, like a stegosaurus. Yeah! Cool! All right, so how do we get started? Just pull it off? Yeah, so you're gonna just pinch a little piece of clay off. Okay. And then you're gonna roll it, use your fingertips to mold the shape that you'd like. So if you're trying to make, um, if you're trying to make a limb, then you know you just want a little foot or yeah. a paw of some okay. sort, right? Ooh, yeah, look at this. Ooh. A really short leg. Yeah. Like this. <laughs> nice. Okay. And how do you get it to stick? So when you make clay attachments, it's called score and slipping. So what we need first is score. needle tools. Needle tools. Oh. <laughs> Nicole. <laughs> I have them right here. Oh. Here you go. You One, just have these needle tools in your jam pack? I have everything in my jam pack. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how do you do it? So, I'm gonna grab them. so you're gonna take the needle and then we're gonna make a little tic-tac-toe mark on one of the bottoms of our piece. Okay, tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-toe. What a fun game. <laughs> yeah, there we go. And then you're gonna do it to the body as well where you're gonna connect it. Okay. Ooh, where should I connect it? Okay, how about like right this. here? One, two, three, four. Okay. There we go. All right. And then in these cups, these are called slips. So what you're gonna do is you'll dip your finger in the slip. Oh, like glue? It's glue. It's clay glue, basically. <laughs> you're gonna dot the tic tac toe. You'll put them together, and then you'll firmly push it so it could stick to one another. Okay. There we push go. Push it together. Oh Whoa. yeah, it's sticking. Oh yeah, it did. Check it Whoa. out. Oh, <laughs> cool. Look at mine. Whoa. Good job. One leg done. There oh, we go. That looks so good, Luffy. Oh, yours too. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Well, guys, your, your animals look great. Thank oh, you. Thank you. What do we do next? So now we're going to paint them. Bring Ooh, them to life. Cool. Paint them. Cool. It looks like we have some paint right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, but these brushes look way too big. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't worry. I have paint brushes right here in my jam pack. Oh, you have everything in there. I really do. I have some more too if you want other options. I have a little one, I have Ooh. a bigger one, I have another little one, I also have a medium sized one, Whoa. and I also have another one that's, oops, sorry, that's oh. not it, that's the tool. <laughs> and I have a tiny one, and I have another tiny one. Whoa, okay, I'll use this one and this one. Okay, sounds good. Whoa, and then we just use these paints and put them on the animals? Yes, you, whatever color you want it, whatever designs you want, you're gonna dip it in and then you'll just paint it onto your to your animal. Awesome, cool. thank you. Let's right. do it. Yeah, since you guys have what you need, I'm gonna go check on the kiln and uh, I'll come back in a while to check on you. All okay, right, thank thanks. you. See ya. <laughs> Whoa, wow. cool. Okay, since I'm doing a tiger, I'm gonna use orange. Oh, good idea. Whoa. And I'm gonna use yellow for my dinosaur. It doesn't look like yellow right now, but once it's baked, it's gonna turn to a nice bright yellow. Oh, cool. Check this out. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. There we go. Okay. Hey, I've never go. painted clay before. Me neither. Whoa, it's really fun. Oh, see? Whoa. Right now it looks like the same color as the clay. Yeah. I can't wait to see it when it's yellow. Yeah. My orange isn't that bright, but I bet after it gets fired in the kiln, then from there, I bet it'll turn really bright orange. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, look, water. <laughs> Pretty thirsty. <laughs> no, no, Blippi. What? That's for your paintbrush. Oh, smart. <laughs> yeah, you dip your paintbrush in this water. You don't drink it. And so then you can use a different color without mixing them. There you go. Oh, thank you. I got gotcha. you. I'll get some water later. <laughs> oh, Whoa. A dizzy tiger. Yeah, look at that. Whoa, this Whoa. thing's so cool. Yeah, hey, your tiger looks really good. Wow, yours too. It's oh, so colorful. Thank you. Oh, hey. Hey, Hi. wow, guys, your pieces look great. Yeah, thank you, you like them? They're amazing. <laughs> oh, why aren't they so bright and colorful? So once we take them and put them in the kiln, the colors are going to get a lot brighter. No. Oh, cool. Can't wait to see them. Yeah, so is my orange gonna get like 
My suspenders and bow tie? Exactly. Whoa, oh. and will mine get as bright as the yellow as my headband? Yes. Oh, or the sponge. Whoa. Oh. oh, cool. Well, what do we do next? Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take your guys' animals and then I'll put them in the kiln and then you could come get them when they're ready. Oh, oh fun. Sounds like a good okay, plan. Okay, here you Kay. go. See you later, Tiger. Okay, be gentle with it. Here you go. Thank oh. you. Bye. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Oh, See ya. Wow, that was so nice for teaching us about pottery. Yeah, that was really nice. We learned a lot. Yeah. I can't wait to see what they look like. I know. That was really fun. Yeah. Well, shall we return the aprons? Yeah, let's do it. And then we can come back to pick up our things. Great idea. All right. <laughs> Whoa, look how they look. Cool. This must be where everyone picks up their pottery. Yeah. <gasps> Ours. Yeah. Cool. What do you think? Oh, she's right. It did turn bright orange. Yeah, it really did. And mine turned bright yellow. Oh, yours looks so great. Thank you. I really like yours, too. Oh, thanks. Hey, shouldn't we go? Yeah, put it by the pig. Yeah, let's go. Come on. <laughs> oh, that was so much fun today. Yeah, that was a great time making these new friends. Yeah. Whoa. Hey, did you notice? They both roar? That's right, because mine's a dinosaur. And mine is a tiger. <laughs> cool, should we roar together? Yeah, will you roar with us? Ready? Roar! <laughs> 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 oh, that was awesome. Yeah, it was so cool molding that clay and creating these. Yeah. And then using the paintbrushes and coloring them. Yeah. Oh. Oh, making art is so fun. Yeah, especially <laughs> with friends. Yeah. Oh. Speaking of friends. Oh, yeah. Hello. Will you be our friend? Please say yes. Please say yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we did it. Thanks, nice job. Good job. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with us? <laughs> cool. B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. Will you spell my name with us? Awesome! M E E K A H Mika. Mika. All right, see you again. Bye bye. bye. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika, and today I'm at Montebello Barnyard Zoo in Montebello, California, and I heard they have animals here and a fairy village. <laughs> so I'm going to be a fairy and grant wishes to any animals or fairies I see. I have my fairy wings on and my magic fairy wand. Will you help grant wishes with me? Awesome! Hmm, let's go find that fairy village. <laughs> hey, horsey, I'm Mika. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> We're looking for fairies. Hey, should we grant this horse a wish? <laughs> yeah! Okay, I need some space. Mika's here with the plan. Your fairy wish is my command. <laughs> Look, horse food. <laughs> here you go, horsey. Your wish is granted. <laughs> okay, see ya. I haven't seen any fairies yet, but check it out. Goats. Hello, goats. I'm Mika. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> Ooh, did you know goats have four stomachs? <laughs> yeah, that's why they're so hungry. <laughs> Do you know where the fairies are? Okay, let's keep going east. Bye, goats. <laughs> Haven't found those fairies yet. <gasps> oh, but I have a great idea. Check it out, a tractor. Let's go on a ride to the fairy village. Hey, I'm Mika, nice to meet ya. <laughs> Can you take me east to the fairy village? Yeah. Oh, great. Come on, let's take a seat. This looks like a great seat for a tractor ride. <gasps> Here we go. Oh. There's so many animals. Hi, llamas. Oh, look, there are three llamas. <laughs> they look so cozy in all that fur. Oh, and look, 
An emu! That's a flightless bird from Australia! <laughs> Whoa! It's a bumpy ride! <laughs> oh, and look! Some horses! Hello, horse! <gasps> look! A merry-go-round! Oh, that looks like so much fun! Okay, hocus focus, we're looking for fairies. That could be pretty fun. Maybe later. I think we're getting closer to the fairy village. Oh, I can't wait to meet so many fairies. <laughs> yeah, we finally made it to the fairy village. We did it, we did it. We never ever quit it. We did it. <laughs> Great job. Whoa, check it out! Look at this! Oh, it's a little forest for fairies! And look, a table and chair for their yummy lunches. Oh, and they got lots of fresh fruits and vegetables. <laughs> oh, and a bridge over glittery water. And a squirrel. <laughs> Hello, squirrel! Let's keep exploring. Whoa! Look! A door! Hmm, I wonder where it leads. Let's knock on it. Knock, knock, knock! Is anybody home? <laughs> oh, just a little gnome. Hello! <laughs> oh, and look! More fairies! Hello, little fairies. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Since you're always doing so much for people, like sprinkling fairy dust and collecting teeth and gems, do you need anything? Oh, you would like a home? <laughs> Lucky for you, I'm really crafty. I know just what you need. Mika's here with a plan. Your fairy wish is my command. <laughs> Coming right up. <laughs> Let's go. We need to build our fairies a little home. Hmm, I have just the trick. Mika's here with a plan. Your every wish is my command. <gasps> Whoa! Look at this house. This is a perfect house for a fairy. Are you ready to paint our fairy house? <laughs> yeah, me too. Wow, there are so many colors for us to choose. Blue, green, like grass, pink, purple, and yellow. And check it out, my two favorite colors are together. We should definitely start with those. Grab my paintbrush. Oh, do you know what this color is? <laughs> That's right, pink. Dip it in water first and dip it in the purple paint. This will be such a cozy home for the fairies. I hope they like it. <laughs> okay, let's do yellow next. Yellow, just like the sun. That looks so pretty. <laughs> and bright too. Okay, we got the front. Let's work on the roof. I think I'd like the roof to be blue just like the sky. Let's do pink with our pink paintbrush. Whoa, we're almost done, check it out. Oh, such a beautiful fairy home. Let's do the sides now. Hmm, what color haven't we done yet? <gasps> green! Let's put some green on our house. Dip my brush. <gasps> Check it out! This is such a beautiful, colorful fairy home. 
Let's go see if they love their new house. <laughs> Hello, little fairies. We made you a beautiful, colorful home. <laughs> Hope you like it. What's that? You love it? Oh, that's great news. Do you have everything you need? Oh, you would like us to help you collect gems? Oh, okay. I got it. Mika's here with the plan. Your every wish is my command. Wow! Great idea. Let's go collect some gems for our fairy friends. See you soon. We made it. <laughs> Let's go get some stones for our fairy friends. <laughs> oh, look. These are the different stones we can find. Amethyst and calcite. Whoa, I wonder how many stones we'll find. Ooh, water. All right, I have my mining tray. Do you know what this color is? That's right, it's yellow, one of my favorite colors. And it's round, just like a steering wheel. <laughs> this helps us sift through all the dirt. So we get rid of what we don't want, the dirt, and then we get our crystals inside. Ready to give it a try? <laughs> Great. Whoa, check out this dirt. Check it out. Look how many gems we got. Ooh, I think this one is rose quartz and it's pink. Pretty. Check out this one. Wow. And this one is black. <laughs> and little. Let's count how many gems we found. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven gems for our fairy friends. Let's go give them to our fairy friends. <laughs> Here we go. Don't worry, little fairies. We collected all the gems so you can rest and relax. <laughs> you get a gym. And you get a gym, little froggy. <laughs> and you get a gym too. <laughs> oh, would you like a gym too? Okay, I have plenty to share. Oh, I love giving. It makes me feel so happy. <laughs> would you like a gym too, little gnome? <laughs> okay. There you go. And you get a gym too. Hope you're enjoying your new home. <gasps> oh, check it out. Look at this little fairy. She's taking a nap. <laughs> Let's leave her a crystal for when she wakes up. Sleep tight, little fairy. <laughs> That was so much fun being a fairy with you today. We got to pet some animals and feed them lunch. Oh, we got to mine for gems and we paid in a fairy house. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Wait. I forgot to grant one more wish. Mine. Hmm. Oh, I would like to ride this merry-go-round. Mika's here with the plan. Your fairy wish is my command. Bye-bye. <gasps> It's me, 
is Lizzie. Hi, I'm Nika, and today we are at Rockwood Music Hall. Yeah, in New York City, New York. I'm so excited to be in a space where musicians and singers get to share their music. Yeah, musicians and singers, they're so cool. And they play instruments. Ooh, maybe we'll see some of those. <laughs> yeah, hey, let's go explore. Okay, come on. <laughs> Oh, oh, check this place out! <laughs> yeah, there's yeah. instruments everywhere, and look, a drum Whoa. kit. <laughs> Mika, that is a cool drum kit. Oh. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. And do you know what these are for? Hmm. Are those drumsticks? You know it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, thanks, Mika. You're welcome. Okay. Ooh. Okay. All right. <laughs> are we you can ready both play. for a drum off? Wait. Okay. are really cool. They keep the beat. You have yeah. to have really good rhythm to be a drum player. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you know when you dance, you need rhythm? But if you want to play the drums, you also need rhythm. Yep. <laughs> Woo. Ooh, let's see what else is in here. It's on this table. Oh, look. A little tambourine. <laughs> and a big tambourine. Hello. <laughs> yeah, these are percussion instruments. Yeah. <laughs> you also need rhythm for these. That's right. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! What's that? This is a maraca. Whoa! You ever seen one of these before? Ooh! Yeah, it sounds like there's something inside. Yeah, what Whoa. do you think it is? Mm, maybe macaroni? Ooh, or beans? Beans! <laughs> <laughs> or maybe rice? Yeah! I don't know. <laughs> oh! Ooh! <laughs> I like how that sounds. Whoa, look at this! Oh, it looks Whoa. like a fish! Yeah! Looks like a fish swimming in the sea. Mm -hmm, but <laughs> Hello. see all these lines in it? Oh, yeah, I do see those, Mika. If you take a wow. stick and run it over this area, it's gonna make a cool sound. Try it out, Blippi. Okay, yeah. here we go. <laughs> Nice. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and it has holes, yeah. So the sound can make a lot of sounds that reverberate and it gets really loud. Yeah. Whoa, <laughs> that's cool. Oh, what's here? Whoa. Have you ever oh. seen one of these before? <laughs> hmm. It's a cowbell. Moo. <laughs> Moo. Here, try hitting it. Okay. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let's hit the cowbell. Whoa. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Should I hit it again? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Flip it. You got the beat. Oh. <laughs> wow, that was fun. Very nice. Ooh. And Mika, what about this? Here, you can hold the drumstick. Oh, do you know what shape this is? Hmm. Yeah, it's a triangle. Yep. Oh, look. It has three sides. One, two, three. Three! <laughs> yeah! Oh, Mika, you want to try to hit it and see if it makes a sound? Yeah, usually you would use like a little metal stick or something to hit a triangle, but I'm going to try the drumstick. Let's see what it does. <laughs> okay. Oh, whoa. It's a very calming sound. Yeah, you hit it like a cowbell, but <laughs> sounds like that. Beautiful. Oh, a recorder. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know those. Oh, I think. You put your fingers over the holes here, mm -hmm. yeah, and then you blow into it. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Good job, Blippi! Oh, hey, I know another instrument that you blow into kind of like a recorder. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> hey, look, there's one here! A flute! This Whoa. is a flute. It's a woodwind <laughs> instrument. Look at Whoa. all of these buttons. Wow, there's a lot. A lot of keys. <laughs> so many. <laughs> yeah, and then see this part, the mouthpiece? Yeah. That's where you blow air into the instrument. Let's see if I can make a sound. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, that was so beautiful, Whoa. Mika. <laughs> Whoa, Whoa. <laughs> you're pretty good at the flute. <laughs> Thank you. I think I need a little more practice with the recorder. Okay, let's try it at the same time. Ready? Okay, here we go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Whoa, I wonder. 
wonder what's in this. Hmm. Ah. It's a case of some kind. Yeah. Instruments sometimes can be really delicate. Yeah. Hmm, that means uh, something that could break. Yeah, easily. <laughs> yeah, so hmm, let's open it up. <laughs> oh, what's inside? Oh, it looks like a tiny oh. keyboard. Check it out, yeah. It's so small. Mm -hmm. hmm. Ooh. Can I give you that case, Mika? Yeah. Oh. Huh. And it comes with this tube. <laughs> it's so <laughs> funny looking. Hey, look at this. Bet if we put that there, oh, maybe I should blow into the tube and see if it makes a sound. <laughs> okay, hey, I bet we can play this with teamwork. Oh, awesome. <laughs> okay, so you hit the keys okay. and I'll blow into it. Okay, ready? <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Let's do it again, okay, ready? Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, it's so loud. It's so loud, <laughs> yeah. This is called a melodica. Melodica. <laughs> melodica. <laughs> That's a fun instrument. <laughs> oh, and Mika, what's that? Oh, this is an acoustic guitar. Oh, check it out. Yeah. It has strings on it. Yeah, <laughs> how many strings are on this guitar? Ooh, will you count them with us? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds really pretty. Oh, yeah, a guitar has strings, and each string is a different note. <laughs> That's right. But, Mika, what's it called when you play all the notes together? A chord. Oh, so beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was a pretty chord. Yeah, I love stringed instruments. Me They're too. They're really, really cool. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, this is a pretty cool guitar. Yeah. Ooh, what other <gasps> instruments have strings? Uh, come right over here and look. Oh, oh. A piano! Whoa. Yeah, check it out, it's a piano! Yeah, here, come closer. <laughs> oh, do you see inside? Oh, what do we see? There's Ooh. so many strings in there. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a lot more than six. <laughs> yeah, a lot. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think there's about 230 strings in a piano. 230 strings? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot, and if you come over here, you'll see the other end well, where all here. of the keys of the piano are. Oh yeah, <laughs> a guitar you strum, mm -hmm. but a piano, even though there are strings, hit the keys. Ooh. That's right, oh here, <laughs> have the seat. Ooh, thank you. Ooh. <laughs> oh, have the seat. Thank you so much. <laughs> hey, because we both like to play the piano, should we play a duet? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> a duet is when two people perform the same piece together. Okay, okay, I'll play the low part, you can play the high part. Okay. <gasps> <sighs> okay, here we go. Ready. slower than you. That's right, we want to play in the same, same time. time. Exactly, yeah. so first things first, you need to pick out an instrument. Okay, um, hmm. Ooh, I think I'll take this fish Ooh. and a drumstick. Ooh. Good choice. <laughs> I think I will also use a drumstick and I'm gonna play the cowbell. Ooh. <laughs> that's fun. Okay, so we're gonna take turns making up a song. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah. But um, what should we sing about? We should sing about, <gasps> I'm feeling a little hungry. Mm, me Maybe too. we should <laughs> sing about food. Oh, food, I love 
food. <laughs> Me too. Mm. Um, hmm. who goes first? So I can go first so I okay. can show you how to play. And okay. it's two lines and the second line has to rhyme. That's the Whoa. tricky part. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that sounds like a lot of fun, but yeah. a little tricky because you need a rhyme. Exactly. Mm. So I'll say two lines and then you say two lines. And if we both rhyme, we win the round. Yeah, okay, let's try it. Okay, ready? Let's keep a steady beat. Okay, a song about food. I like vegetables and I like fruit, but I hope I don't spill food on my suit. I really like to eat ice cream. I think Mika and me make a nice team. <laughs> that was so good. Yay! Nice. Oh, that was awesome. Woo! It's hard, right? Yeah, really hard. You have to think so much. Yeah, you really have to focus to keep the beat and try to rhyme. Whoa, it's kind of like patting your head and rubbing your tummy. <laughs> Basically. Mm. Okay, you choose the next subject. Hmm, okay. Uh, this time, let's do. Woo, colors! Oh yeah, that's a good one! Hmm. Uh, and this time, I'll go first. Yes! Okay, let's go! <laughs> my favorite colors are orange and blue. I know how to tie my shoe. Purple and yellow, that's my thing. I like to dance and I like to sing. Whoa, that was a good rhyme. We did it again, yeah. round two. Yay! That, means... <laughs> that was tricky. Yeah, thanks but we for got you playing that game with me, Blippi. Oh, well, yeah, I had a lot of fun playing with you, Mika. And thank you for playing along with us. Well, that's the end of this video. I hope you liked the Blippi Mika show. Can you spell my name with me? Everybody spell it. One, two, three. <laughs> okay. Will you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Philippi. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with us? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> <laughs> well, see you soon. Yep, we'll see you next time. Come on, everyone. Let's make a learning fun. Mika, Mika. So much to learn about.